Hi guys, Dave here with my buddy Ghost. Our barbecue's dead, so we came out to the woods where some buddies of mine are putting together a, a little campsite and uh, we're gonna cook some steaks out here instead. As far as I'm concerned, it's better over an open fire than it is on some barbecue with propane anyway. So, that's what we're doing here. Let's get started, get some firewood. We gotta get some coals going. We don't want the fire touching our our steaks too too much so we got to get some firewood and get a coal base going Normally, where I come from, up in the Muskoka area, there'd be birch bark all through here. Getting a fire going is really easy. Down around London, Ontario, southern Ontario, there's not... I, I don't see any birch around here, like, ever, actually. I don't... I don't think I've ever seen a birch down. I'm sure it's around, I just haven't noticed it. But, uh... It's a little more work to, uh to prep for a fire when you don't have birch bark. Um, there's no pine in this forest either, really, so it's a matter of processing down a little bit of wood, a little bit of, a little bit of dry shavings, get your fire going. I'm using my uh, Buck Selkirk. I did a review on that a little while ago. I should mention. Now, I did say you can hang it different ways and one of them is a sideways kind of hang which I was probably gonna do but I heard it was a pain in the butt it is a real pain in the butt so basically you're gonna want to figure out if you want to carry it normally or as a side-to-side -side kind of configuration and and then leave it like that because yeah it's it's a little bit of a pain to get done and uh, I almost, uh, almost broke a finger, I think, doing it the wrong way. Um, but even the right way, it's, it's, it's still a little bit of a pain. Um, I've had the opportunity to use this knife a lot more often, and uh, I, I still really like it. Still holding up. I uh, I really like this knife. And uh, to the guy who broke into my truck, if you're watching this and stole my old bush knife, you're still a dick. I like this knife, but my other one I like too. I thought it was better. You're still a dick but I like this knife. So after a couple of attempts, we get a fire going. Down in this little area, everything's so damp. 
might want to move the campsite to higher ground, guys. Everything's so damp down here. I don't know. But, uh, I would have had a shot of me getting the fire going, but my dog started to throw up, and I threw everything into here and went over to him, and when I came back, there was already basically kind of a fire, so I just started adding to it. Ghost is okay. He ate some grass that didn't agree with him. Probably some stinging nettle, too. Maybe, but I didn't bring my gloves. Oh. I'll do a video specifically for stinging that'll let you guys know what to keep an eye out for. Uh, it's not like poison ivy anyway, it's, it's, you know, a 10 or 20 minute irritant. Okay, so, like I say, after a few attempts, we finally got a campfire going. So we're gonna, we're gonna work on this for a while, let her get down to some coals, and we'll get back to you with the steaks. Fire's still a little bit high, but we're losing some light. So we're gonna get on that. Oh, I bring steak. Look at that, that's like an inch thick. And that is some serious meat. Bam! And we're cooking. Smoke in the eyes, always fun in the bush. And post time. <sighs> Normally I like uh, Alexander Keith India Pale Ale or uh, Miller Genuine Draft. But every once in a while, Sleeman's Honey Brown. Goes great with steak. And I brought another one for the steak. I'm Just did the first flip. You can see, like, the flame's a little high and it's charring the outside of the meat. But, uh... Meh, whatever, that's okay. I've cooked it right on coals before, and uh, a little bit of charcoal won't kill you. No better meal in the woods there, eh? All right, so. A little bit overcooked for my liking. I eat blue rare, the rarest of the rare. Juicy. Mm, beer. Got to do this shot right, eh, guys?
steak, beer. A little bit of potato salad with that. Because that's how I roll. Beats a barbecue. A few things in this world better than a steak cooked over an open campfire. I'm going to enjoy this. I wish I could share it with you guys, but video. Like and share, comment, all that good stuff. Have a good one.